and this is another um, not a work in progress as such I've actually finished the map now of my first level in UDK um, I've got a few problems that I still uh, need to figure out but um, this is pretty much just a, you know the finished thing I've now managed to make you know the doors there's one there and there's also uh, one there they're team specific now so obviously you know blue team can run in red team can't get in. I've still got the same problem here with the texturing I haven't figured out how to fix that yet which is a bit confusing how um some text you know some objects are fine whereas others seem to have that problem but another thing is that I added some you know, I've got a door there. Um, same problem with those objects. They look extremely terrible right now. I'm not sure how to fix them. But oh, let's see what I can do to fix it. I've added, uh, because it's obviously a capture the flag level, I've now added the intelligence down here. So you've got the blue intelligence there. Um, obviously, the red is on the other side. And the main thing I have added, though, is change the main room on the left hand side. The, down there is the same, it's still the same watery area. Um, I'll go down there just you know because I made it a little. I changed the lighting a little bit so you can see where you go. I've set it so you've got um, you've got full health up here, which is obviously barrels. Um, I've obviously got a pile of crates on the other side for color coordination, but there's obviously health up there too. One thing I have added is I changed it around here, so I've managed to make it managed to make it look almost like this building is underwater. Um, what I did here was I got glass texture which looked slightly industrial like you see the grooves there on the glass um, I added a skybox and made the skybox like a dark blue sort of colour and then I added water um, vertically I took a block of water and I added it to the face that was obviously facing me and I turned that into a block of water so now you've got this underwater you know you've got this underwater Ripley effect and the dark blue skybox I've, well, I might still mess around with lighting though because one thing I'd like to do is I'd like to get a spotlight there and a spotlight there and sort of make them larger to um, instead of it look like there's just lights here make it look like there actually is more of a water glow coming from the outside into this main room but I'll have a mess around and I'll find out how to do that um, one of the things I have got a problem with at the moment though is I don't know how to make a server in that I'd really like to playtest this level with some friends, um, but I don't know how to. I've looked at tutorials at how to do it. Um, I'm having some problems right now in the sense that the whole download the um, HD something or other, you know, dedicated server thing. Um, I'm aware that I could also go onto the tools section and download TF2 dedicated server, but for some reason it's not there for me. Um, I can't find that. Um, one of the reasons that these blocks are here, by the way, it's not because of bad modelling, but um, it's because I want to uh, get like decals for red and blue on these blocks. I'm not sure if it's the right thing to do or not, but that's why the blocks are sticking out. Uh, so obviously, team specific doors. So because I'm blue, I can't go in the red door. Same thing the other way. The uh, capture points do work, so I can now go get this intelligence and grab it. We have taken the enemy intelligence. Uh, this pretty much was just a, well, more like a final show, really. I mean, it's not, you know, final, final, final. It's not finished. The actual base itself is finished. It's ready for me to play it. Um, I still want to fix it, though. I want to fix things like, obviously, I want to get the decals on there. And I want to find out what this problem is. Um, but anyone that can give me a hand or just explain to me why... I'm having trouble making a server or like, you know, could perhaps point me in the right direction, I'd really appreciate it because I do really want to try this level out. Um, I don't know how it plays, I don't know if it's going to be fun or not, um, that's obviously why I want to play it for playtesting. I have to go around here, I changed some of the lights, uh, I lowered some of the lights to make it, um, you know, a little bit brighter. I'm aware that I mentioned that you perhaps won't be able to see what team you're on because of the, you know, how strong the lights are down here. Um, that's another reason I want to test this out because I want to see if it's a game killer or not I mean obviously if you find your teammate their name will appear on their head so it might not be a problem it might be a problem but that's one of the reasons I want to play this
there we go, same thing here, and pretty much that is the, um, well, this is the showcase of my level that I've made, so, um, any help on what might be- MEDIC! Um, excuse me, what might be the problem here, I'd really appreciate, um, you know, a bit of an explanation as to what that might be, and also the most important thing is how, how can I take this map and then put it, you know, how can I make a room with this map on it and invite friends into it? That's one of the. That is the most important thing that I want to figure out. Um, thank you very much for watching, and oh, well, I'll post up another progress finally if I can get these things fixed. I'll put up one final progress video. Fingers crossed for actually being played in action. Anyway, take it easy.